everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Nitanjana from Leo Tales, and today we have an international subscription box here, which is for all the cute kawaii stuff. So today we have here you make twins, and this is a Japanese subscription box. So this box was sent to me for consideration. If I like the box, then I can go ahead and make a video. And I received the box, and I like the stuff. So I thought I'll make a video, and I let you know, guys. And also. This is an international box, but they offer international free shipping as of now. So that is one reason why I thought I'll make a video. Basically, they have three boxes. One is the Yume Twins, which is like a cute lifestyle kind of box. The next one is a beauty box, which is No Make No Life, NMNL. It is for $29. And they also have a Tokyo Treats, which is a snack box. So these are the three boxes. And today we will be unboxing the cute box. So it raised me in perfect condition. And it is not per se a personalized box. Everybody will be receiving receiving the same set of products every month like for example if you're ordering between august 1st and 31st you are actually ordering the september box if you're ordering on september 1st you will be ordering the october box so that is how the ordering goes payment is with credit card you can also pay via paypal and i think that's a bit safer option also so without wasting much time let's get started and see what we have in this cute kawaii box or the Yume twins so once you open the box, you have all the products neatly packed inside and it says Konichiwa, which is something related to Kawaii, I guess. So all the products are separately packed and also most importantly, the products are all branded in some way or the other, which are all like uh, products of some Japanese characters or something that is very well known. So that's good. And this is the info card or I should call the info booklet. It contains information about each product and a little bit more information about the star product and some other things. Also, they have the you may price every month. That is whenever you subscribe to a box, you are naturally entered for this contest where you get price worth more than $500. And this is like every month there'll be a contest. So that is also pretty amazing. When one of you will stand a chance to win if you're subscribing to the box. And then there is something about the art of the month corner and all that. So uh, I appreciate this uh, big leaflet or the pamphlet which has the details of each and every products and it's very cute in itself. So now we'll get started with the products and see what we have. The first product in the box, if you can believe me, I received an egg boiler. <laughs> I, I am so excited because I was not expecting such a product, such a practical product to be part of a lifestyle box and this egg boiler, see it is, first of all, it is not operated by battery or anything or, or even electricity, you just have to pour hot water and it is so travel friendly actually and this is how it looks like and they say that this month we want to shine the spotlight on the kawaii Japanese egg boiler included in the box. It is called the Onset Tamago Maker or a Hot Spring Egg Maker. Okay, that's good. It can, You just have to add hot water. Open the uh, lid, place the eggs on that particular rack, place it back, pour hot water and keep it on for like around 22 minutes and you will have boiled egg. You can also make it half boiled. So definitely this is the star product and a little bit of information is here in the box. So even if it is completely Japanese, it's still fine because you have an English pamphlet here. So this is definitely the star product in the box and I definitely, I really liked how it turned out to be. It's so cute, right? This is the second product and it is a plush toy. <laughs> I, I, I'm feeling excited like a kid. So this was the second product in the box and definitely a great addition. And as per the info card, there is a little bit more into it. So this, my Melody Roll plushie, this month it appears as the first ever Sanrio plushie that has been in a kawaii box. So Sanrio, I guess it's a brand. Now this will be the first among the three in the series, which means I believe their May, June boxes must have had the other three from the Sanrio range. So the plushie is very, very cute and no doubt about that and I absolutely like it. It's so splashy. It's so neat and white. I don't even feel it touching it. So this is the next product in the box. Good at Thima. The third product in the box is this. If you guys remember, this was part of my uh, Yes Style haul and this is actually uh, it's a peeling gel by Holika, but do you see this icon and the shape of the egg? So this is actually the Gudathema egg. Gudathema is actually like a, let's say, a, a lifestyle icon or something. And it is the lazy, sad egg, which you can see the facial expression. So this was part of the Gudathema special series. And I was excited like a child when I got this. And that's when I received another product from Gudathema, the Gudathema range. And it is a, it's a 
uh, to-do list basically and it has several pages and you can see the Gudatama egg right there it is so so cute and this now kind of completes my <laughs> collection as well so this is how the back side looks like and the paper quality and all is very good so this is again from Sanrio at the back side the details are all mentioned here so this is the next product in the box and <laughs> Yeah, because I have both of them together and I just can't stop loving this. The next set of products is a set of four sponges which you can use for cleaning or I think maybe you can even use it for like cut it into pieces and use it for a nail art. But these are very cute soft sponges and it has a rather a strong, uh, a hard base also and there are some designs and all going on at the base. So I wouldn't really call it just a sponge but the designs are very cute and something is written in there. So this is the set of four sponges and I like them very much and I am yet to find out a purpose because I'm definitely not going to use it for cleaning because it is too beautiful to be used that way. This will probably end up as a prop in my photos. So this is the next product which is like again a set of four sponges. The next product that I have here, it's, uh, it's a squishy, it is the Happy Chan Squishy. So the info card reads, wait, who is this? Why is it Happy Chan? The Happy Chan's first appearance in a kawaii box as well as our first character squishy. Okay, so this is the first ever squishy in a character form. And that's pretty cute, right? And squishy balls, they come in handy, especially if you have, if you are someone who has anger issues, then you know, when you get really angry or frustrated, you can just uh, use all your energy in squishing the ball. In that way, you will save from a lot of save yourself from a lot of trouble maybe by shouting out or whatever and it's also bad for health so the squishy ball is very cute and then again this can easily be on your desk it will look so pretty and you can also maybe hang it in your car or as a keychain maybe this is really cute and this is the next product and i like it i like um i feel that maybe i should like take a look at these characters maybe these are uh, part of some uh, Japanese series maybe I'm not aware of still I'm happy that I'm getting some cute stuff out here and I'll definitely do some research behind this so this is the next product in the box moving on to the last product even I thought initially for a moment that it was a nail paint but it is not a nail paint it is a marker and you will get a random color marker I and mean, you would have gotten a random color marker in April. So the one that I got is green and it is very pretty also. So this, I like the cute, I, mean, I always have a thing for this kind of cute stationery. So this is the Amusis Popular Bunny Character Port USA Loppy brings you this kawaii highlighter. It looks stylish like a nail polish on the outside. It is actually an adorable highlighter and they're available in five colors. Okay, so this is the last product in the box and my Yume Twins box is empty right now. I'm not throwing out the box because the box itself is very cute. It has these uh, some patterns and all going on, some cat pattern and all. So definitely I can throw it out. So that's everything I got in the box. Uh, for $35, well, it is sort of a pricey box, but considering that you also get not just cute products, but something that has some benefit to you, something that is practical, then I feel that Yume Twins can be given a shot. If you like international uh, products, if you are someone who follows Japanese, uh, maybe their uh, CDs or Japanese uh, cartoons or something, then I believe these kind of products or boxes will make more sense to you guys. So let me know which is your favorite box and what do you think of Yume Twins. And if you want me to review the other boxes like Tokyo Treat and NMNL, then I'll only be happy to do that. So that's it. Uh, you will also have a link in the description box, which is an affiliate link. So I will be very honest with you guys. If you order through that, then I'll have some affiliate money from that. It will not take you any more anything from you but it will just be something between me and the brand so i'm letting you know guys about that as well so that's it i hope this video was helpful to you let me know what you think of you may twins i'd like to know that from you guys so we'll meet soon with another video until then take care